Welcome to Herald of Glory Devotional. Today, Sunday, March 21st, 2021. Theme, called into fellowship. 1 Corinthians chapter 1, verse 9, King James Version. God is faithful by whom you were called unto the fellowship of his Son, Jesus Christ our Lord. The word translated fellowship in our anchor scripture is the Greek word koinonia. It generally means association, communion, sharing and participation. Precisely, it means to have full and complete sharing or participation in something or someone. The closest English rendering is joint airship. We read in Romans chapter 8 verse 16 to 17 that the Spirit himself bears witness with our spirits that we are the children of God, and if children, then heirs, heirs of God, and joint heirs with Christ, if indeed we suffer with him, that we may also be glorified with him. Having been called into fellowship, koinonia with Christ, we share in all that he is and has, both his glory and suffering. That is your calling in Christ. Koinonia is used distinctly from another Greek word metoke, which is also translated fellowship in English. It is used in 2 Corinthians chapter 6 verse 14. Do not be unequally yoked together with unbelievers. For what fellowship has righteousness with unrighteousness? What communion has lies with darkness? Metoke on the surface almost means the same thing as koinonia, but not precisely. Metoke is like co heirship Joint heirs and co heirs are not the same. For instance, whilst co heirs can share what they both have as inheritance by parting it into two separate portions, joint heirs cannot do the same. In joint heirship, the partners always have a share in each partner's portion, even if they parted the inheritance into two separate portions. They are joined together to share in the same things with the same right of ownership at all times. This is the kind of fellowship you have been called into with Christ. That is huge. Christianity is no religion. It is a call into divine fellowship with Jesus Christ our Lord. In the theme scripture, Paul says it took God's faithful love to bring us into this fellowship, koinonia. You have been brought into permanent fellowship and airship with Jesus. Enjoy it. Confession. Please confess. Thank you, Father, for the sweet fellowship you have called me into. My fellowship is with you and with the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Reflection. Having been called into fellowship, koinonia with Christ, we share in all that he is and has, both his glory and suffering. Further reading. 1 John chapter 1, verse 3. That which we have seen and heard declare we unto you, that ye also may have fellowship with us, and truly our fellowship is with the Father and with His Son Jesus Christ. Acts chapter 2 verse 42 And they continued steadfastly in the apostles' doctrine and fellowship, and in breaking of bread and in prayers. Read the Bible in one year. Second John The perfection mandate, the Lord Jesus is coming for a glorious church, matured, perfect and holy. Perfection is the goal of the church. And this is the unique focus of Herald of Glory devotional. Join the impact train. We are uniquely focused on heralding the Lord's glorious church. Join us in spreading the message of the Lord's glory and perfection to everyone in our world. Kindly contact plus 233-555-500-100 plus 233-555-500-100. Two four four five two eight six three seven plus two three three two four four five two eight six three seven Herald of Glory Impact at Gmail dot com. Follow, like, and share Herald of Glory daily on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Pastor Julius Glowfield Christ Lord, heralding the glorious Church. Herald of Glory Devotional, Your Perfection Manual. Enjoy a perfect day. You are blessed.